So the War Thunder update trailer has dropped for Firebirds. And man, the Gaijin devs cooked. Here's everything you need to know about it. It opens up with what looks like to be an airfield rework. But don't quote me on that because that could just be for cinematic purposes. We got a new German Cold War SPEZ. I'm probably pronouncing it wrong, but it's the Lush. We got our first look at the F-15E. This is the Strike Eagle, so it's going to have better striking capability. We are shown the T-77E1 MGMC. This is the new American SPAA. The teaser trailer does show off an American Patriot system but I doubt it's actually coming to the game because it's going to have a really good range and kind of outperform everything else. We are shown what looks to be new afterburner effects, along with the Russian Su-34. Then we got the South African Super Hind for Great Britain. And then we got the KV-7 U-13, which is supposed to be in the Dreams Come True event. I think this is the German APC again. We got what looks to be a more glide bomb, so a lot more nations other than China are going to have access to them. Then they showed off the wing vapor effects that are supposed to be coming this major update. Remember, these are probably not final and they're probably still tweaking them. And the crowd is about to go crazy because we got the first look at the F-117 coming to the American tech tree. And yes, that means we're going to be getting more and more stealth aircraft as the game progresses. There is a naval vehicle included in this dev trailer. I have been told it's a sister ship to the HMS Renown. Then we got another look at the F-15's afterburner, which is looking quite hot. And then finally, we got a look at more glided bombs, this time for Russia, and they look kind of overpowered already. 